Hello, everybody, and welcome to War Resident Evil. The heavy Metal Thunder here. Throw me too. And we're going to a door. Zombies! They exist in this game. Just thought I'd let you know. In case you didn't know. Oh no, right behind you. Behind you, oh, man. No. Aim down. That one's probably not dead. No! It bit your uh, foot. At least when they get my foot, I know my foot. One shot. Get over here. Alright. Zombies are dead. All zombies are dead. Everywhere. No more zombies. I'm gonna have to go heal real quick. Yep, hopefully these zombies don't respawn. No, I should be dead. Yeah. You're not the infinitely respawning ones? No. Okay. But this next part I'm about to go in is extremely dangerous if I'm not well prepared. We need to turn off the thing again. Come on, see if you can do it. There you go. I knew you could do it. There, now I can actually hear myself talk. Yeah. It's amazing. There we go. Herbs. Hey, it's amazing. Look at this herb. This herb is amazing. I think it's just red and green, it looks like. Two green. Oh, no, it's just green and green. That'll be good. Nom it. Wrong, Snort buddy. that shit. You got full health now. I can tell because that bar is like all the way to the max. I don't have to look into that. So I think that's how it works. Just the small, the closer the bar is to flatlining, the closer you are to death. Alright, this part is extremely dangerous. These creatures in here. It's dangerous territory. Proceed with caution. A lot more dangerous than anything we've been on too so far. Oh dear gosh, run. Whatever the hell that thing is. We haven't even got a name for these new things. Ow. Those are extremely dangerous. I got both of them on my ass right now. That's not good. End of the third one. Okay. Yeah. Just run. Did you activate the panel? Yeah. Keep running. Ow. It's a code out foot machine. If I had a mo disc. Damn. I forgot to bring a mo disc. I hate when they're on the rope. I can't get them. I just sure you can do. You got him. Oh. That's why I was having trouble killing him. <laughs> You're on the pistol? And I'm about to die. Oh. Well, I don't know how to get a modus. There you go. I oh. I told you those things are dangerous. But now that we know that there's a mode disc this way, we can grab the mode disc when we're coming through. Yeah, the mode disc reader. <coughs> Yay, Capcom. I've always liked that little opening Capcom thing where it goes. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Yep. It's kind of cool. 
It's one of my favorite Capcom logos. It's just silly. Anyway, yes, we once again enter some bullshit, you know. <coughs> Good luck. Yes, bring the square crank with you. That'll be exactly what you need. <laughs> Are they like in separate parts of this whole build, this section? Yes, the mode disc guard. Are the mode disc readers? Yeah. All three mode disc are in your possession. So. Yeah. Are you like shooting the screen and like smashing the screen? Yeah. What the fuck? It's a weird effect. Uh, uh. That's just silly when it does that. Alright, they're dead. Alright, we're entering dangerous territory. Proceed with caution. Good shot. The thing this gun still one shots all enemies ever. Except for bosses. But doesn't even need a one shot bosses. The bosses are bosses. Damn it. Man, I won't lock into him. What? I won't lock onto him. That's what my problem is. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. Nice, nice. Double kill. We still got six bullets left. Are these like the only time they show up? No. Oh. That's after this part, that's gonna be like Remember where those zombies were? Are they gonna be everywhere? That I told you that was like in that one section. The infinite spawning ones? Yeah. They'll yeah. be there and they'll be everywhere. Oh, joy. Except when they're there, they can't get on the ceiling like they can here. Oh, well, you can run past them then. Well, are these like the hunters, or are these a new type of enemy entirely? These are a new type of enemy entirely, in fact. Do they even have a name? They did. I don't know if they do or not. Get them. Damn it. Good shot. It's two down. You're like not on top of it. Yeah, this game is so fishy about being. Yeah, if I had a mo disc. Yeah, yeah, we got a mo disc. Passcode three. Yay! We'll look into that later. Uh, it's not really important, but you know what it actually says. Okay. Probably need to go back and kill. Yeah, if these things are dead forever, do you think dead forever? I think so. Okay. We'll oh. find out here in a sec. Okay, it looks like it. As long as they're dead forever, then it's worth healing. We got the MODIS passcode. We need another mode disc in our inventory anyway. Okay, these things are still dead. That's good. Yeah, it's just that you have, like, once they start appearing, then you have to, like... Actually, there's an event, I think, that occurs first before you have to really worry about them being everywhere. Okay, that makes sense. I about to say, that really, other than them just appearing, it really hasn't been an event yet. Hmm. Well, I mean, yeah, other than me yawning, but that's not really an event. Let's see. 
Oh yeah, full health. Cool. I can tell now because I figured out how to read that damn thing. Yeah. It's just that first spike. If it's at the top, you're at full health. Anywhere else, not. Yeah. I've always just kind of paid attention to the words and thought ain't nothing else really changed. But apparently it does, because in this game at least, that little spike changes. That little spike changes depending on how many times you get hit, so... Run! You just won! Run! Run to wherever you need to go! Oh, was that there? Uh -huh. Monkey! Monkey man, no! Yay, power outer generator! Power connector switch. The elevator is powered off. Will you connect it? The power for the elevator is active. As the power supply and the circuits have been connected. Yay! I don't know if that's anything. Doesn't look like it. <sighs> Only just really anything that's going to work now. Yeah, let's look around because it could be some kind of health that hey look another computer. Activator. It's quite big. Oh. That's what she said. <laughs> it's quite big. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yep, we're out of there. Yay, no like more of that I guy. Said that, that part was dangerous. Yeah. That requires two healing objects. And all your magnum rounds. Yep. And you're out of, like, good bullets, huh? Yep. Shit. You're down to the pistol. That's no good. That's I'm no gonna... good. There's another part here before. Yeah, it's behind door number two. No, I also <laughs> think it's another puzzle. Uh, hopefully there's no enemies in here. No, nope, this is a puzzle. Okay, good. And we got shotgun shells. Yes! That's shiny. I'm gonna turn one of those blue, those red, blue, or uh, green, blue ones into something special. Alright. Basically, what we're gonna have to do here, and you see these three things? Yes, push box one out of the way, push box two out of the way, and push staircase into vent. Yep. Doesn't seem too hard. Because the, the vent has a button underneath it. So, I thought you had to push the two boxes is what you had to do. You do, but there's a special way you got to do this. Okay. Well, you got to push all three boxes on these buttons. Well, see, the other two are gas vents. Oh. The boxes see. cover up the gas vents. I see. Now I gotta do this. I 
That's pretty sneaky, sis. Did you push it too far? Let's find out. I don't think so, but... I don't know. Well, you gotta push that one up now. No, I'm gonna have to go around and push the stairs over there now. Okay. Okay, what's the purpose of moving them up at all? Probably what I'm supposed to. Oh. I'm just trying to get them out of my way. Let's see. Alright, down. Move it to the wall. Well, don't want to move it exactly to the wall. See if you can push that down. Two spaces. Okay. There you go. Now you can push it to the wall. And push it down. We just one smidge meter down. There you go, perfect. Uh, you guys move it a smidge meter up. Alright, now, now you can move it all the way through. Go, go, go! And button's been pushed. Let's okay. go. Hold on. Hopefully that keeps that puzzle solved because I, I need to go to low disk. Oh, I see. Yeah, good point. And you need a heal. Yeah. I'd say healing would probably be more on a top priority. I'd find that more on a higher priority right now. I don't like being close to death ever. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. Although at the same time I don't like wasting items either. So. That usually ends up getting me conflicted. Oh, what type of herb is that? Does it look like it? You mix the herbs? Yes. Yay! Awesome. That was amazing. You put the... Did you get the modisk? Shit, no. <laughs> it's like, did you get the bow disc? I mean, I know healing was a higher priority, but bow disc is also a priority. Bow disc is also important. Might as well grab the ball. Yeah, probably not a bad idea. <sighs> yeah, bow disc. That's a square O. I see what you're trying to do. You're trying to be all organization. Yep. I'm trying to be all organized and shit. Yep, I'm doing my my thing. Yep. My monk thing. Trying to be all neat and even and mm -hmm. thing equals ten and Oh crap. No Bullshit. Curse of resetting the puzzles.
Damn. Really were sold. Yeah, that was bullshit. Should have gave you a little ding. But you know it was solved. It should have been like doodle 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 doodle. -doo. That way I wouldn't reset upon entry. Okay, just go across the bottom and then go up. We'll go around the side, one or the two. We'll just go here. Push that up. Go around. Break it down. In funky town. Okay. There you go. Now push it all the way down as far as I can go. That's as far as I can go. Push it all the way against the wall and push it a smidge meter down. Does the pump trap activate when you push the button on your dead foot? I might, I don't know. You totally just push the button with your foot. You know, the boxes were covered on that, so. Yeah, I know. I'm just hoping my box is all of that. There you go. Just go. Just go. Yes. I think if my memory serves me correct, that's more magnum rounds. Yep. Yes. More magnum rounds. Don't want to leave yet. Mm-hmm. This is Modisk Leader. That's code 2. Yes. Do you have to actually memorize any of that or is it just automatic? No, nope, it's just automatic. Uh oh. It was a book from the Bible in Genesis that they were quoting. They're quoting, yeah, but I'm just saying, uh, but let's, as far as the passwords, you don't have to memorize any of that. No. Alright, just run. Just run to the third Modisk thing, wherever it is. Then after this, you should be able to enter the last door, right? I'll go into that door down there, I think. Just shotgun them. I don't know if these ones respawn either, but... Just shotgun them. There's more shells on the table there, looks like. Oh, that's a fax. To General Manager Sanitation Division from the Special Committee on Disasters, Raccoon Special Research Department. This memorandum is strictly com confidential and must be destroyed as soon as it is understood. Regarding the T-Virus outbreak, which occurred recently, this committee conducted a field survey. According to the survey results, estimates on the amount of damage caused by the accident are considerably greater than reported earlier. First, although it is very difficult to obtain accurate data in terms of actual numbers, it is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-virus. The body count will most likely increase since nearly all of the survivors show symptoms peculiar to the T-virus. Second, our security system is still in operation, however, our special security guard squad has been nearly destroyed. Because of that research information considered by our company to be top secret, has been made available to outsiders. Countermeasures should be taken as soon as possible. Finally, many of the subjects from the experiment have escaped and are out of control. We believe that some researchers were killed by these subjects and their bodies were mutilated. By curious coincidence, these events are proof of the success of our research. However, there is also a very high risk that this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. 
The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain. However, we hope the problem will be solved quickly. We are especially concerned that the state police and STARS are interfering vainly too quickly. We need to act on this situation as well. Yeah. I'm coming. Passcode one has been filled. Mission accomplished. Boobs. Cardboard, some posters. Nothing useful. But I'm still taking the poster. <laughs> poster has been added to files. <laughs> yep. Now we get to finally figure out what happened to some of our people. So we get to finally figure out the truth. You went to the passcodes. Is this in game now? Uh, not totally, because you still have to do a couple more scenes, but. Well. This is where you get to find out what happened to Jill. Where that save room was that we've been coming kind of from. Oh, I see. So, was all that just to see her real quick? Yeah. It's all At that the end, you gotta go get her. Oh, I see. I think those bigger things are there already. See, down this hallway is an elevator, but we're going to save. Mm. We're going to save. And we're going to grab the magnum. Oh, yeah. That'd probably be a good idea. Grab as much healing as, as possible, think, too. I think we're about to get into a boss fight. Mm-hmm. The, uh... Dang it, what's that? the final boss fight. The I know, I know. Two. The, and, uh, no, 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 no. There's a term. I think there's a, the, a semi... Uh, There's a term for like the second to last boss. Oh. I think. The penultimate boss. I think that's it. Glad we checked that clip. Making sure all guns are loaded. Mm-hmm. We don't have a lot of ammo. We're gonna have enough for beat the game? Hopefully. Right. Save this will we'll be the last save, the last save ribbon will be saved right for right before we get to the boss. Oh, the last save ribbon right before the final boss? Yeah. Okay. I thought this was going to be the last save ribbon. No, I got two. I know. <laughs> Why do we need to use the other one? Ain't after a certain scene it goes into something, something, something. You'd be able to save one more time, I think. Yeah, replace that with healing. Best healing you can. Dollars of blue herbs. We still have a first aid spray. I know. 
I see. There you go. Alright, now we're ready. Take on the penultimate boss. This is the Tyrant 2 or something like that. I don't want to spoil it. But first... It's bad about that this whole game. You've been spoiling everything. <laughs> Make it a surprise. Build suspense. Rebecca. Rebecca, you're safe. I saw you in the garden. I caught up with you at last. Well, I'm glad you're all right. Don't go out alone. Yes, sir. Hmm. <sighs> Final new door transition. Chris, as my subordinate, you have wonderful talent. I would never work for a company like Umbrella. And Wesker, you were formerly with Umbrella. What do you mean? Since when have you been an Umbrella agent? And a traitor to the stars. Now you're wrong. I was formerly with Umbrella, yes. Rebecca. Don't move. Now walk. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> but but that's moving, sir. The fuck? Oh no, Pirates. it's the experiment they were building. I was mentioning the thing. Wow, I think that's cool. Is this? That's right. This is the ultimate life form. Tyrant! Shadow the Hedgehog? Oh well, you know Tyrant. Oh no. They've released him. Yeah, Whisker's like, Oh, you can prepare for the ultimate doom. I will release this thing and do will kill you. Get him, my minion. Get him. Think you're gonna kill me, bitch? I tell you. Man, he died. Look, the blood spilled out. He'll never be heard from again. Uh, you wanna grab your controller? <laughs> I'm just like, I don't wanna grab the controller. I know the boss fight's about to start. What do I 
actually want to try fighting the boss too. I think you might be almost dead. Uh, heal. I would love to do all kinds of stuff, but... And she still got some healing in the bed, in the case. So you're not totally screwed. Yeah. Oh, another shoot where I can't tell if it's a guaranteed hit or not. Uh, dude. He's down. Uh, I would move up just a little bit. I think it's down. I think it only goes down once. Oh, no, never mind. It's, I guess it's still up. I'll wait for it to stand up again then. Or maybe I'm supposed to look at Wesker. That might be true too. Or activate something on here. Maybe. Looks like the control device for the room. Unlock the door, yes, there you go. You unlocked it. I wonder if you had any ammo, you bitch. What a miserable death. I think you wasted a lot of your ammo on them, dude. Hate to say it, but I think you wasted some ammo on them. Probably did, but I couldn't see where I was at. I know. We yeah, was I falling to die. I got that. You're still alive. He is sleeping with the ultimate failure. Okay, oh, So is that truly the end of Wesker? Or will he return? Da 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 da. Thingies. They go bladder, 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 bladder. Okay, I'm kind of worried about one thing. What? You don't have much ammo. You have three shotgun shells. Is there any other ammo somewhere? If you were going to save, you missed your chance to do it. No, actually. What, maybe? Things just hump in the air. Oh, I ate that shotgun shell and just kept coming. Did you see that? Yeah. I know it hit it too. It was like, boom! Hit it, and then just ate it. Yeah, I would. Yeah, probably... I pretty much think this is the end of the game. And I'm probably pretty much screwed. I wouldn't save. Why? Well, here's my reasoning behind it. You don't have much ammo. You might screw yourself over. You only have, like, okay. uh, 24 handgun bullets and two shotgun shells left. I'll just grab some mixed herb just in case you have a chance to survive this. It's all blue and green, I think, because this game likes to give you more blue herbs than you really need. Instead of red herbs. Huh. I <laughs> barely give you any red herbs. No. What you actually need. Add a loud obnoxious noise. Self destruct sequence initiated. Yay, dodge. Two of them are about to get me. I know. Is it this way you need to go or upstairs? I have to go get her. Oh yeah, right. 
Dun 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 Go! <coughs> da na 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 na! Happy music. Yay. Let's go. There's no need to stay. Ah! The noise is back! <laughs> yeah. Run, Jill, run! This guy dodged like one room of enemies. No, not even that. Just gotta run up the stairs. Oh, yeah. I would, but this can't see won't let me. <laughs> I know, huh? I'm frozen in place. Because yeah. I cannot move. It's just because they didn't want you to have her her with you, I guess. Because of the combat. Because of possible combat. <coughs> they didn't want to have to design a uh, health bar for her. Yeah. I could actually understand that. It makes perfect sense. They didn't want to design a health bar for a companion person. Combo zombie. Nope. Okay, good. No. No. Let me in the no. damn door. Oh. There's another ba box out here, ain't there? Yeah, I was gonna grab a her from there. Yeah. How did you get past those zombies? I just wanna know. Yeah, I'm in danger too. Yeah. Eat all your herbs. Eat all the herbs. Oh num 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 num. <laughs> you got plenty of them, so eat them all. You might as well put your magnum away if you don't have any bullets for it. Unless she can give you some bullets for it or something. Well, that's just some bullets at the boss fight, which I doubt. There you go. Make sure there's no actual, okay, no more. I was going to say make sure there's no actual red and green ones, but at least you have a few things to heal yourself with. Yeah, see if there's any that might not be. Blue. That looks like blue too, so. Oh well. Oh well, let's... I don't think it's the ladder. I think it's the... the hello? Okay. I forgot the... I guess the elevator's upstairs, ain't it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it is. Okay, there it is. That's what I was thinking of. I thought this and the box were in the same room for some reason. Can we do it? Let's find out today. That was the radio finally kicking in. Yeah. Should have kicked in earlier in the game. Should have. Oh, what's this? What is that? The battery that I need to grab. I forgot I also have to have a space period to grab stuff. <laughs> That's bullshit. That is so bull. Cause it gives you the last chance to grab as much stuff as you can. If you have healing, then you want to grab healing. Yeah. I 
I can't hear any room for any of this! You two girls against them, they don't stand a chance. Well, maybe they can wear them down with their bullets. I mean, they got bullets. Yeah, we don't. Hey, can you love me so your bullets? <laughs> <laughs> we do well, I'm sure it'll be fine. They can take that boss. We just need to get that helicopter's attention. All will be well. Yay, no more annoying sound. I'm surprised they didn't do more with the... Yeah. What do we got here? Oh, Flare. Got it. Woo! Yep, Rick Flair. Yep, Rick Flair in a box. Now attack with the Flair. Stand right where the helicopter's supposed to land. I know, huh? Ah. Uh, yay, mission accomplished. Hi. Drop the bazooka. I know you got one on board. Just drop it. Uh-oh. I like how all these scenes that you have to watch cost like half your time. Yeah. Fucking use your shotgun bullets. Not yet. Probably need to heal though. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit. You're yeah, fine now. Alright. Get him. If he hits you again, okay, it's heal. Heal now. Never mind. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh well. Now you get the. Now this time, when you get into the fight with him, this time, in that first phase, freaking use. Like, like, get in a camera where you can kind of stay far away from him and shoot at him and if he starts it's falling down said than done. I know it's easier said than done it's not impossible either and this time once you kill the first form yeah I knew this you were time maybe I won't be wasting all my mag you can't waste all your magnum rounds that's too important I might take my pistol and try to find him in there with the pistol. Don't try that either. That'd probably be a horrible idea. Save the magnum rounds, though. And this is only the first form. Uh, then I gotta... If I could manage to save all the magnum rounds. Wait. Okay, try it. You have shotgun shells, though, too. Crap, right? how far back am I? Just right before the boss. Okay. You done the jail thing. This was just like you said right before you went to go fight the boss. Okay. So just go try and take him out. Maybe with the shotgun. So this is kind of a. I only got like three shots anyway. Yeah, exactly. Then you can put that away, and then all your magnum rounds are used for the final boss. And then you use those right away. You know what I'm saying? We'll fucking piddle foot around. I don't think I'll get skipped this scene either. No, it probably not. Becca, you're safe. Hi, We show how to take out this form with a little bit more pizzazz. Probably call it an episode until you get to the second form. Well, no matter what, I'm going to go ahead and save up to this battle. Good point. When you save again, that's what we'll call an episode. Yeah.
that she died horribly. Maybe we'll just call an episode there. Chris. I won't have a stupid plan to get killed here in five minutes. Chris. You wanna watch? I'm about to do some stupid shit. You wanna watch? <laughs> Pretty sure that's what he was going for was a biological weapon there, buddy. Bum ba da ba dum bum 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 bum. Don't move! Come over here! <laughs> Open this door with a cutscene. It's Mega Man boss door. Wait, no. No, it's not a shutter. It bubbled. It's the bubbles! F fucking bubbles! <laughs> yeah, we can skip that scene. <laughs> we can skip that scene. How do you know we can skip that scene? It's full motion video. <laughs> huh? It's full motion video or FMV or some crap. Not full motion. Uh, it was a it, it was a cutscene. It was a cutscene cutscene. It was a cutscene and a cutscene of a cutscene. Yes, it was a shinier cutscene. Oh, that's how. Because I'm you, an idiot. And the you, fucking you cool bubbles boy. are loose. I'm releasing the fucking bubbles. You cool boy, you creation idiot. I'll show you. I'll show you. Idiot, go get him. I mean, creature, go get him. Oh, God. That's pretty much the equivalent to what's happening right now. Go to hell. Jill will join you too. What? Don't come this way! What? Don't come this way! Ugh. Is this the end of Wesker? Will he never make another appearance in Resident Evil again? Find out next time. Or or Resident Ball Evil 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. All the movies. Is this the end for him? Run that way. Ouch. I'd love to do something. But I forgot what I was doing. Apparently it involved getting my ass kicked. <laughs> it really involved getting... Wait, 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 dude. Oh, shoot. Okay, right about... Damn, darn you cameras. Aha. Uh -huh. Move forward a little bit. If we got to bring killing with you at all. Oh all right, move God. forward with you. Move forward a bit. Yeah. Move We're forward. probably going to do... Oh, crap. Move right there. Just aim. I'm dead. Damn it. I screwed myself. No healing. Yeah. Plus, I forgot to how to run there for a minute. <laughs> Braid part. <laughs> Just don't hit me a bunch of times. Whip my ass. <laughs> Braid part. I won't let you kill me. Am I supposed to be doing something? <laughs> Something just seems to miss here. Oh yeah! Run like hell! <laughs> okay, hold on. End of episode. Right. See you guys next time. Well, for the finale. Of yep. Let's play Resident Evil. Even if I have to play it 100 times, we're going to end this. Next time. <laughs>